Oh, beautiful. Alright guys, let's save the day. Why the fuck am I holding an assault rifle and a sniper? There we go, that's better. Captain's log, yellow alert. I'm moving the ship to yellow alert. While we have seen no signs of trouble, I'm not sure we won't run into any geth this far out. We are prepared for anything. I've been told it's a terrible idea to go this far out to ward geth territory, but these colonies need to defend themselves. Something I think the uh, what? Sometimes I think the only thing keeping the crew from shriveling up in fear is the 100 crates of military grade weaponry on board. A little surely when we get to the Nifral health system, we'll do us some good. We have a lot of deliveries to make, it's not going to get any friendlier out here. Red alert. Moving the ships, red alert to get for attacking. We're ill-equipped for an attack of this magnitude, but we'll do everything we can to survive this. These colonies need these weapons, and this attack is further proof of how dire the situation is out here. Signing off. Oh, I guess it gave up pretty quick. This will be the last entry in this log. Given the severity of the Geth attack, I've ordered all hands to evacuate and head toward the colony. Should the Geth succeed in capturing this ship, they also gain control of 100 crates of weapons in the cargo hold. Therefore, I'm using my authorization codes to scuttle the ship, hopefully destroying the Geth that are remain on board. I intend to stay aboard to make sure the ship dies gracefully. My plan is to disable the ship's engines, thus causing our orbit to decay. This will bring the MSV broken armor down to the surface where the self-destruct timer will destroy the ship. I must be careful. If I fail, there's no telling where this ship will end up. So I did fail and it's crashing towards that or the GIF have changed the impact side. Hi there! Uh, okay. Why is the captain vlog all the way out here? Oh, fuck off! The captain got shot in the head around here. This dude. What have we got? We've got medical station. Got plenty of time to have a look around. Engine rail ride. System report. What have we got? No navigation. Life support. Nope. And engine status disabled. Great. So they're really behind this box for some reason. Let's override the engine room. It gives us access into there. And that's everything, yep. So now we need to turn the engines back on. In order to save the planet below. Right, so I think this is just a case of pressing two buttons. Oh, I think you've got to... I should bend them for a second. Fuck off! Shit. Wait for a bullet. So you've got to activate them. You've got to wait without getting shot. That's one dumb. Some iridium, I want it. Because the other side will activate the other coupling. Ow. Ah, fuck! How do you fire that rocket? It was on fire. There's a gap. I don't really think he really cares about fire, to be fair. There we go, that's both couplings done. Now we just need to turn the engines on. Ow. That's fine, they got him. Overloading their system. Restart the engine. Oh crap, it's a puzzle. Um, okay, what we got? So, that one to that one. Uh, that was that one. Oh, God, uh, that one to that one and that one to that one. That's how you save a ship. Press Y's together. You keep saying that, Miranda. Oh my god. Stabilize the MSV broken arrow. Remaining Geth have disengaged. The colony is safe. Okay, any messages? Yes, finally. The Normandy, our thanks from the Fargon colony. That was a colony that was just about to be destroyed before we saved the MSV broken arrow. We retrieved your identity from the docking data aboard the MSV broken arrow. We're led to believe that your crew is responsible for saving our colony from a catastrophic event. I mean, we didn't let them know. We didn't tell them that. They would have been worried about a ship crashing down. Not only did you defeat the Geth and prevent the ship from crashing into the planet in the tra trajectory fucking hell, that would have destroyed our colony, but you've also saved nearly 100 munition crates that could have been lost in the ship's scuttling. Thanks to you, we're in a safe condition and can continue the Broken Arrow's work in arming the colonies on the fringe of Geth space. On behalf of the residents of Fargon Colony, you have our eternal gratitude. Okay, so I'm just going to have a look. 
Not any upgrades that we have. Uh, so we have damage protection, I'll take it. And emergency shielding, oh my god, have we nearly done them all? Uh, maybe muscle weave, okay. Okay, I think that's all of them besides the medbay upgrade. Oh my god. Upgraded everything. It's awesome. Right, so I'm just going to have a quick look at the galaxy then. What have we got? We should have 100% on everything now. Let's just do one last double check. 100%, 100%, 100%, that one's done, 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 that one's done, that's done there, done, I think there's a system behind there, yeah, that's done, 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 oh, oh, 72 actually, we need to do that one then, so one we're currently in, I must have missed a system, uh, done, 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 and that's it, so it's just a system we're in, apparently I've missed something there, and then we need to do the two DLCs. So what am I missing here then? Oh, it's Kirosium. How did I miss that? Well, then let's go there and just have a quick look. If there's nothing there, we'll go back to the galaxy map. Yeah, so there's nothing there. Let's have a quick look at the journal. What have we got? So there's still a system marking that we missed. That's the main mission. That's the main mission. That's the DLC there. Um, yeah, okay, any assignments? There's a Forge ID, it's there in family data, and some DLC there. Right then, let's go to Ilium then. Okay, so after doing Vayne's mission, you find some DNA, uh, I think it's like some DNA or something for a Solarian, and it's this guy here that needs it. What is it? I'm in the middle of an important call. Yeah, if you're gonna be a dick, I'll go somewhere else. Is this the data you're looking for? Corosa Generational Archive. You found it. Thank you. My whole family has been worried. That data is irreplaceable. I didn't think I'd get it back from Nasana's corporate building. I'm glad I can help. There's your data. I hope it helps your family. You have no idea, human. I, I don't know who you are or how you got it, but thank you. Here, for your you don't know who I am. Blessings be upon you. I come on, the shepherd. I saved your ass. You saved the galaxy. Fool. So I'm just going to double check that we got all the terminals for Liara and I'm just going to check the shops as well, make sure we bought everything. And then we'll go speak with Liara and start the Shadow Broker DLC. Yeah, so there's a terminal that I did miss, which Liara wants. Let's hack this. I've got to find out where the source is, I believe. And I'm done. Easy. And so you've got to follow it down to where it begins. It's all the way over here. I didn't mean. Okay, look. I'll take another look at the There it is. Shepard, this Done. is Liara. I've got the data. Come see. Trust me. The goods coming in from the terminus. God damn it! You caught Liara. And I got renegade for some reason. Hmm. Well, whatever. I don't know, let's go back to Liara. We'll put our findings and we'll start the DLC. Right, and so we are back at Liara's office. So let's hand in the reports that we got from the data terminals, and then we can go after the Shadow Broker. Shepard, it's good to see you again. Thank you for getting me that system data. Here, it's not much, but hopefully it will help you on your mission. Do you remember the Shadow Broker? With the data you got me, I may be able to find information caches from his agents. What did that exactly did she give me? It didn't exactly say. Is it money? I won't complain if it is, but I prefer something actually useful. Um, so you're really going after the Shadow Broker. I'm just going to presume that he's after you. What kind of a question is that? Who is that? What the fuck? I was like, all over Mass Effect 1, and Liara's been mentioning him non stop this entire time. Ah, uh, whatever. Is, is he after you? Are you in trouble? Are you on the run from the Shadow Broker? I can help you. Actually, it would be more accurate to say that the Shadow Broker is on the run from me. We crossed paths not long after you died. Since then, I've been working to take him down. With this data, I'm a step closer. Um, go to, to come with me. I'll help. You can't come with me because you're after the Shadow Broker? What if I help you find him? I'm sorry, Shepard. The galaxy doesn't work that way. I need to find leads, trace information. I need to work. I can't do that on the Normandy. I wish I could. Well, good luck, but I've got to go and save the galaxy. 
Let me know if there's anything else I can do. Thanks, Shepard. I will. Now, is there anything else I can help you with? <laughs> you know, just let's ignore the last conversation. Let's go get the Shadow Broker. I know you're looking for the Shadow Broker. Cerberus yeah, she just told us, you to find dumbass. It. Interested? Absolutely. I had no idea. Let me see what you've got. It looks like a leaked transmission between Shadow Broker operatives. Some hints as to the location and... It's about Farron. He's still alive. Who's Farron? He was a friend. He helped me recover your body from the Shadow Broker. Why did the Shadow Broker want my corpse? He was going to sell you to the Collectors, but Farron and I stopped him. Farron sacrificed himself to save me. So you rescued me. Then how did I end up with Cerberus? Well, they gave me intel to help recover you. They actually put Farron with me in the first place. After I got out, I gave you to them. They said they could bring you back. And you believe them? This is Cerberus, the guys that do like crazy experiments and killed one of the Admirals. Uh, well, I guess let's be the good guy. You saved me, Liara. It actually worked. You kept me out of the Collector's hands. Without you, I couldn't have come back. Thank you. I didn't know how you'd feel when Cerberus restored you. If you'd feel betrayed, or... They brought you back. And now they're giving me a chance to find Farron. After two years, I hadn't even dreamed. Well, let's go get him back then, shall we? Any friend of yours is a friend of mine. What's the next step? I... I don't know. I need to prepare to think. I'm going home. Use my terminal if you need any local intel. You okay? I've spent two years plotting revenge. Now I have the chance to make it a rescue. Let me help. I'll come by your apartment. Okay. Hopefully I'll have a plan by then. Thank you, Shepard. Go in. Okay. So we look at a terminal there, so it's like we can interact with it. But I believe there's actually nothing on here. Yeah, nothing. So what's the point? I think it must be a, a glitch that the developers put in that they removed some content. Because it, it looked at it like I should interact with that and do something, but then you can't do anything with it. So I've just one point in here. No, it's just one of the terminals. So we've got to go get a taxi to Liara's apartment, and we'll carry on from there. Seal off those trace samples and get them back to the lab. And Ilium Cop. We got multiple shots fired. Yeah, techs are going over the place now. Oh, that's looking good. Central, we got an open carrier on this end. How long have these guys been here? Coded relay. What's going on? Okay, she's suspicious. This area is sealed off. Please step back, sir. Sealed off? Why? Someone tried to kill your friend, Commander Shepard. Thank you, officer. Your people are dismissed. Well, you're a named person, so you're going to be important. You can't do that. Already done. Okay, I guess she can do that. Let's go. She said she could do it, so let's just leave. Of us here. Special tactics and recon. Spectre. Spectre. I heard your status was reinstated. Good. You're one of our most famous operatives. Might even get you to sign my chest plate. Oh, okay. So, I'm I assume you had business with that. your friend this evening, Commander. Liara was following a lead on the Shadow Broker. The Shadow Broker? Dangerous enemy to have. She... Uh, she would have left a note. Let's look for that. Liara was expecting me. She would have left a message here. Her office wasn't safe. I'm not surprised. Ilium is just Omega with expensive shoes. I haven't found anything useful for tracking her down yet. You knew Tassoni better than I do. Where would she have hidden her backups? Let me take a look around. I don't know, so I actually get to walk around Liara's apartment. Looks like someone tried to kill her. So was that inside the apartment, or so someone tried to snipe her through the window? Oh, my old armor! It's part of my old armor. Looks like someone didn't like you much either. I never get that why she says that. It looks like someone didn't like you much either. 
What does that mean? Somebody collected the armor and it's on display now. Liara has sentimental value about it. She liked it. You know, it'd be cool if I could take it back though and wear it. It's like some armor. Be nice for the DLC. It's Ilos. That's one of the paths that you drive the maker on. I reckon the developers just took a screenshot and then put a filter on it. Kitchen, nothing there. It looks like an office. Mm, ooh, a degree. A doctor from the University of Ceres, Althesia. She's getting good use out of all that education. And let's go upstairs. Let's, what have we got? Shit view. So they just have a look at this. So it's a bit out of an outdoor section. Should have put like plants in there. It's like three fucking trees and a wall, a grey wall. Okay, so I can only interact with a picture here. Well, she's teleported up here. She's gonna find this useful at least. The picture changed when you touched it. It must be keyed to your ID. What does it show now? It's a Prothean dig site. Liara did leave a message. There are a few Prothean looking objects around the apartment. Let's see what we can find. Okay, so let's look around the apartment again. What about the one right next to the bed? Those things must be worth a fortune. No, just a rock. Um, that's my llama. Is there something over here? Oh, it's her again looking at the desk. More relics. And then there's this one. It's always the last one I check. Vasir, I've got something here. Backup disc. <laughs> I got away my whole thing. I always look like the grenades from Mass Effect 1. It looks like she recorded a call. What have you got for me, Sikat? It was tricky, but you paid for the best. I can narrow it down to a cluster, maybe even a system. How soon can you have it? Shouldn't take long. Come to my office. Area Frontiers in the Dracon Trade Center. Gotta say, though, to Sony, you're making me a little nervous. How big is the trouble that could come out of this? Relax, Sikat. I'll see you in a few hours. She's in danger. We have to help. This must be important. The Shadow Broker's people already tried to kill her once. I know where the Dracon Trade Center is. My car's outside. Let's go. So we are is meeting that Solarian here to exchange information. The Barry of Frontiers offices are located on the third floor. I don't hear police chatter. We must have missed the party. Nope, I think we're right on time. Liara's in there. Oh wow, the voice actor actually put emotion into it. He never does. That's like the only time he ever does it. I'm making funny. Sounds robotic on purpose. Let's try and make him more immersible. This could be a problem. Yeah, no shit. Thanks, Miranda. They just took out three floors to make sure she's dead. Really? It looks I'll like they just took the out one. Car and seal off the building from the top. I'll start down here and work my way up. We'll meet in the just middle. Leave some for me. Oh, then can we help anybody here? What about this injured dude. Who are you? What's going on? No, it's just in shock. Surprised there's no paragon options there. Wow, so it affected a f two floors up, but it still fucked everything up down here. Wow. Elevator! I'm not gonna fucking use that, am I? The elevators are out and building security is down. No shit. No alarms, no police. I think it's that voice on the intercom. I believe that's the same voice actor that plays Shepard. Which makes this situation even weird. Weirder. Area frontier employee. Looks like he got caught in the explosion. He's saying that, but there's dead people everywhere. There's loads of dead bodies. Why don't I focus on that one? Let's actually start moving up then. Going to the diner. Okay. It's a med kit. I'm gonna guess there's gonna be a fight soon. This looks very arena-like. It's cover everywhere. Set the bombs, killing everyone. 
casualty here. <laughs> he said he was like dead before he died. Wounds. Watch yourself, this here. They use military grade hardware. Bullet wounds. Guess this was more than just an explosion. No oh, shit, so blew up the facility and then sent mercenaries in to clear everything up. Let's get the resources and we'll head in the other direction because I think this door's locked. Exolar Shipping, that's an awesome name. Yeah, we've got to go over there because there's a green thing on the front. That music can go through. 